the education department uh, said it was leaning towards the resumption of school in August, but experts from the University of the Philippines also recommended a suspension of classes until December. Talking to One News, the chiefs to One News is the chiefs, Dr. Mahar Lagmay, who represents the group, clarified that they were talking about when would it be safe for students to be physically in school. Now, based on their studies, Lagmay explained that the majority of interactions occur in the zero to 19 years old age group. It is the interaction that we want to minimize because if we uh, reduce that kind of interaction in that age range, then we reduce it, we reduce the transmission significantly. Lagmay also clarifies that learning does not stop when kids do not go to school. Lagmay says that with today's technology, there are different ways that students can keep up, can be kept up to date with their lessons. Because there are alternative means of, of learning. There are servers that are called Nandun, the E-Light PH. No? Nandun, and dami dami pwedeng basahin ng mga bata. And that they, I don't think one year is enough to consume all of that. No? Uh, that can be reproduced, yung mga raspberry servers na yan. At a very, very low cost, it's being used in some provinces, we can mass produce that to address the problem na, na akala ng mga tao mahihinto ang learning. That's not what we're saying.